A lot of people were complaining about what happened at Memorial Gardens the other day. You yeah. did have to close early um, to people and there were big lines. Well, what are you doing to yeah. ensure that that's okay. going to be a little more comfortable? Yeah. Um, first of all, they didn't really sort of close early. They extended the hours. They cut off the line because mm -hmm. they knew that with the number of people, it was going to extend over the hours. And they worked uh, much later than anticipated and we tried, we want to do that. What we've done this time, and we have listened to people's um, uh, complaints, and, and justifiably, you know, I'd be upset too. I mean, but what we've done is that these people will be able to come inside, out of the weather, sit in the seats. Now, does that mean that once all the seats are taken up, there won't be a line up outside? There very well be, but it's the best that we can do. And I, don't, I think it's really unreasonable to think that, well, you know, you have to do something else for them. We're doing the best we can. So people will be inside. We will try to move them a lot quicker because we're going to have more people immunizing. And we will have it, uh, the flow through should be much better to accommodate them. And who have you gone to in terms of staffing sure. that? We have um, reallocated all of our staff in our health unit so that any available nurse that we have um, will be there to, to do that. We have also been working very hard over the previous months to get people for our flu assessment centers. So we have to ensure that they're qualified, they, they are who they say they are. We have also um, uh, gotten, we, we've advertised on our, um, uh, through different organizations. We have addressed retired healthcare workers. We've gone down that road. We've looked at, um, we are looking at sort of VON and paramed and in discussions with them. We've gotten paramedics which have really, we've, we've, we're using them already and they've been just a tremendous resource. They've done a, an, an excellent job. We're looking at the possibilities of nursing students, medical students, all. So when people say, how come you couldn't have planned this and why didn't you do that? Well, as of early, last week, the polls were showing that not very many people were interested in getting vaccinated. We do have these other people. We can't be pulling healthcare workers from acute care hospitals, long-term care homes. That have, they're already at a surge capacity that is near 100%, just at the best of times. So there's not a lot of room to, to, to work. So uh, we have been being down the, the bushes to, to get people and we will have a lot more people uh, for these clinics.